Now we're going to try and use the equations for a converging lens. Uh, this is the exact same board that I just made the ray diagram for, starting with the object, ending with an image. Now we'll see if the equations agree with what I've drawn. So given this object and this lens, so the object is at a distance 0.1 meters away from the lens, the focal length of the lens 0.2 meters, and the height of the object here 0.1 meters. So find H of the image, D of the image, and the magnification. So M is H image over H object, which is minus D for the image over D for the object. So let's see. Um, I don't know M, H, I, or D, I right now, so this isn't going to help us. Not yet. Let's try the other one. 1 over F is 1 over distance to the object plus 1 over distance to the image. All right, this one works because I know F and I know distance to the object. So if I rearrange this, 1 over distance to the image equals 1 over F minus 1 over the distance to the object. Okay, so 1 over the distance to the image is 1 over 0 0.2 meters minus 1 over 0 0.1 meters. Okay, so this is 5 inverse meters minus 10 inverse meters, which is minus 5 inverse meters. Okay, so then if I take 1 over this side and 1 over that side, I get distance to the image, 1 over that, equals 1 over minus 5 is minus 0 0.2 meters. So distance to the image, so from the lens, it should be 0 0.2 meters away in the minus direction. And remember in the lens, the minus direction is back on the same side the object was on. So minus 0 0.2 right there. So the drawing was good. So the distance to the image was minus 0 0.2. Now, I know the distance to the image and the distance to the object. So minus distance to the image is minus 0 0.2 meters over distance to the object was, where is it? There, 0 0.1 meters. So that's, let's see, minus and minus cancel. 0 0.2 or 0 0.1, this is two. Magnification is two. So the object is two times as large as the image. And it's a positive number. Magnification is positive, so that means it's enlarged. So that's good, too. So the only thing left now is the height of the image. Well, height of the image over height of the object is 2. So I'm running out of space here. It's height of the image over height of the object is 2. So that means height of the image is 2 times height of the object, which is 2 times... 0 0.1 meters is 0 0.2 meters. So, which is what's drawn here. 